Alright guys, what is going on? And today, we are seeing what's on my iPod Touch 4G. Let's get into it. And alright guys, so starting off with the case I'm rocking. It is the blue case on the uh, Tips and Tricks video. You can check that out on my channel. Just click the little link there. And I'm, uh, yeah, it's just a thin case. I'm always on the move, so it's good. Instead of the other Batman case, which is also in that video. Go check it out. And so yeah, that's the case. So turning it on, I have a uh, Justin Mahler wallpaper. It's the uh, Batman one, because Batman's awesome. And um, I just really love his work. And I just don't, I don't have a passcode on here right now. Passcodes aren't really important to me, so just bloop. Oh, come on, there we go. And so let's get into the apps. So let's get into the first row of apps. So on the first row of apps, we have messages just for you know communicating with people um the bible because i'm christian and it's good to have it on the go um i have calendar which is really nice because it's got like the month and all that calculator which is really awesome because if you flip it it has a scientific thing it's really nice for school and in the second row we have this etc folder which has twitter but the app isn't supported on ios 6 so i just have the link to the website um, Google Plus for my photos, because that's where I'm backed up on my tablet. And uh, thumb puts up, by the way, if you want to see what's on my Android. So, yeah, that might be coming. Block Shot Revolution is this fun game where you just try to um, uh, hit blocks with this circle thing. It's really fun. You should check it out. And then Beach Buggy Blitz. Um, it's not a great game with this hardware. It's it's really buggy, but huh, no pun intended, actually. But, uh, yeah, just... Don't, don't, well, try it out on other devices, but don't check it out on this one. Moving the next row, we have Clash of Clans. Um, my name is, uh, Bob on here. If you want to check me out, I'm in a clan. Actually, my clan kicked me out, but, yeah, if you're in Clash of Clans, you know what I'm talking about. But, uh, yeah, that's a really fun game. You can build your, uh, defenses and other things. There's, a uh, Trivia Crack. I don't play that too much anymore. But I think I'm like level 51 or something. I don't know. It just kind of got boring. Guitar Tuna is a uh, app that you can use to uh, tune your guitar. It's really cool because I play guitar. And uh, it's really accurate too. It doesn't even matter if your mic's good or bad. Um, let's see. Headspace is a meditation app. Um, uh, it might sound weird, but it actually really calms down your brain. Like you'll have less stress and things. Um, the clock for setting timers. Uh, reminders. It's pretty accurate, but I hate how it only lets you start at a minute. It won't let you do any seconds. That's the only thing that's terrible about the, the clock. Settings. It's where you change almost everything. App Store. Forgetting apps, obviously. Camera. Because I like having it handy, so I can just right-hand it. Um, the main bar is Hangouts, which I am a Google user. So, I use that on my uh, tablet for communicating with my friends and things. So, using it on here is, and it syncs perfectly, so it works out for me. Um, mail, for checking my mail. Email, I have a couple emails and it works great. Safari is browser I use on here. Pandora, because it's like the only music app that is uh, supported on here that doesn't need iOS 7 or anything. So, I don't know, it's alright. Pandora's okay, I'll give it some credit. But I'm not a big fan of it, so uh, let's go to the next page. Alright, so on the second page, the next row of apps is uh, Speed Test, which is an app that you can use to test your internet speed, which mine isn't doing great right now, but it's alright. Um, 2048 is a tile game where you combine them. I think most of you know uh, that game. You just kind of combine numbers and see how big of a number you can get. And fun fact, this game was actually made on my birthday in 2014, so... At least on Android, at least. But, uh, yeah, I thought that was kind of cool. Samsung Mobile Print lets me print from all my devices, pretty much, because you just do it from Wi-Fi. I can do it on this and my tablet. And FaceTime, um, it's just, you know, what FaceTime is. I mean, if you don't know what FaceTime is, you're living under a rock. Contacts, where your contacts are. Maps, Apple Maps aren't that great, that's why I don't use them. Keeping my second page. Camera stuffs, because I am into cameras. I have vid editor free. 
it's a little buggy. Um, it's got ads and stuff, but it's free. And then from the pinch, I only need a couple clips, and it it, it works. Lapse it is a uh, time lapse application, so you can do time lapses on here. And um, uh, voice memos is for I want to try to use for voiceovers, but I haven't really got to do that yet. <laughs> like plug in my earpods. YouTube captures to make YouTube videos on your device, easily editing them and stuff, but this has a horrible camera, so I'm not going to use it on here. Um, notes is for taking notes, obviously. Reminders for lists I made. Um, photos to access your photos. Weather, okay. iTunes for music and movies. I don't really use all these that much, but I still have them here in case. Game Center. I don't ever use less to like save progress in games. Music. Um, I use all my music on Spotify, but I can't use Spotify in here, which stinks. But I don't know. So I don't have any music on here, so yeah, it sucks. Magic Jack is a thing for calling, so you can call straight from any of your smart devices. It's kind of cool. And then the last page um, is just stuff I can't delete off the screen, pretty much. I never use. Videos, stocks, newsstand, and passbook. And yeah, I just never use those. And that's just my gym homepage on a, a shortcut. And that is pretty much it. And I almost forgot to tell you guys the uh, home screen I'm using, I just moved videos real quick to give you a better view, is an iOS 7 wallpaper. Um, so you may know a tech YouTuber named Mac Mixing or Dom Esposito. He's really cool. You can check him out. Um, he, a uh, while back, he exported all the wallpapers somehow from the iPhone 5S of iOS 7 to actual pictures. So I just downloaded it, and now I have it on here, even though this is running iOS 6. So I think that's pretty cool. And, um, yeah, that's my home wallpaper. Alright, guys, that is what is on my iPod Touch 4G. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a like, because if you like it, you like it. And make sure to subscribe for hopefully more soon. Peace out, guys.